All right, we got a sixth grade tiny home project behind us. Uh, this is a math project that involves anything from simple adding all the way up to slope, calculating the pitch of the roof. So kids get, they learn a little bit about tiny homes and we provide a ton of materials and we basically say, okay, look, you're gonna scale down a house to either half inch, three quarter inch, or one and an eighth inch equals a foot. The kids kind of wrap their brain around what that means. We look at a ton of floor plans and try to understand scaling from a bird's eye view. They draw a floor plan and then from there, they start building sidewalls or drawing them out. And then they really start to struggle with, it is a foot of space enough to walk through between my, my sink and my kitchen table? And all these little problems that they don't really, they've never really thought about start to come out. And the math is what usually always solves those problems. We used fractions to scale down our building materials so that they would fit inside the walls that we needed them to fit in. And so basically, we, it was hard because if it was 1 32nd off, then we had to change the whole thing. And it took lots of time to change them. And it was very frustrating. It's constant problem solving. Mr. Weaver, how do I do this? Or I have a problem, um, I think my window's too low because my counter's right there. And all these things they have to fix and the iterations they go through, real world applying fractions, decimals, percents, and tons of geometry as well. I think it was like decently like hard but also fun because we had we got to make our own things that like fit us kind of. But it was also like hard because you had to have the perfect measurements. So like if one thing was wrong, like the whole thing you would have to like um, move everything around you just to make it fit that one part. I like Mr. Weaver's math class because it's a very creative way to teach kids math and they probably don't even know they're learning math while doing this and lots of other kids don't get this opportunity and I think it's really fun.